What's going on everybody? Doc from Average Gamer Guys and we are back for the final, final double painted PCC opening. You guys know it if you've been around a little while. If you've just jumped into the channel you probably see a lot of suggested videos on the side for other PCC openings. Once you watch this one, go watch the rest of them. If you've been here a while, go reminisce on some of the good times to go watch some of the previous videos. I don't know how this one's going to fold out. We've got 70 left. We're finishing up the double painted weekend. We've got just a little bit of time left. We're going to see how we can do. The last four or five openings we've done honestly have been amazing. Let's see how we can do. This is what we're going for though, guys. This is it. I had this feeling when we set out with this kind of three-part little final PCC opening series that we we're doing and broken them up so you know they're a little bit shorter, easier to, to view videos. Um, we want Titanium White Zombas. That's what we're going for. I won't be disappointed if we don't get them, but I will be absolutely jacked if we do. And then obviously if we can pick up any more of these, we've done really, really well for all these openings and be able to grab black markets. We can snag a fire god. It's the only one we haven't seen yet. Paint a mainframe or paint a solar flare. Down to take any of those. And then obviously anything else that we can snag during the course of the time of this. I'm going to be super pumped for, but here's what we're doing. We're going to open 70 of these. We've got all of the rest of the trade ups through all of the crates that we've done. So we'll do those at the end. We'll take a quick inventory and we'll go from there. So with that being said, Whatever day you're watching, hopefully this is a good day for you. If you're finishing your day out, hopefully it was a good day for you and you have a good tomorrow. And if you're just starting your day off and you're and you're watching a video, first of all, thank you. We're going to start off with some pretty sweet gray Yamain wheels. Um, but hopefully you have a good rest of the day uh, if you're just starting off. And if you're in the middle of the day, well, hopefully the first part was good. Hopefully the back half is even better. And let's jump into this. So we kind of flipped the script. If you've been here... Uh, and what been watching some of these if you watch from the beginning you know we were spiking some of these really solid items at the beginning this past PCC opening the the second portion of the 65 we did we uh, we hit our bangers we hit our really solid items at the end so we're gonna see how this one plays out I'm down to grab some more black markets I'm just let's get the zombies here this that would just so cap this thing off and this just entire long weekend of double painted double experience PCC openings that we've been doing um, not only it's already worth it whatever we get out of today doesn't honestly matter I've been stoked with what we've gotten beforehand this is all just extra bonus in my opinion on top of it um, but obviously if we can get some really sweet items today uh, I would be really happy that's black <laughs> so this is sweet this is basically non-existent and uh, people like the non-existent boosts, and I can see why, because this doesn't get in the way from a competitive sense. Um, and I try to dabble into the competitive side of Rocket League, obviously, like RLCS and all those kinds of things. But um, this is really cool. That's a solid pull. That's a really solid pull. I'm happy with this. That's really neat. So a couple of really cool, very rare import level items. Again, we're still looking for the black down mains, too. But that's what we're here for, guys. We're here for White Zombas. Let's just do it. Just cross your fingers. Let's just keep keep it going. Uh, give me some love in the comments down below. Hopefully we can snag them. If not, again, we've got, we've got a couple trade-ups at the end. I don't want to rely on those. I'd like to actually crate these. Uh, but if we can't, we've got a couple extra options. I was taking a quick look through the inventory. We're going to do okay. We'll be, it'll be curious to see how many, um, how many actual import trade-ups we end up getting, though. Uh, just because we've got so much good painted stuff from the imports, it's going to be hard to get rid of some of those. So uh, we'll have to see what we can do. I'm more inclined to get rid of the Comet boosts than probably anything, but we're really making a pretty solid collection of those as well. So pretty excited for that, but we've definitely got a lot in the very, very slot that we're going to be able to move up. So we'll, uh, we should have some opportunity here. But again, hopefully your day is going good. Sincerely, this has just been such a fun section of series to do such a fun uh just so much fun on the crate openings just been having a ton of fun obviously getting some really really good items the solar flare at the end of the last one was just uh it was nuts so happy to see that got the crimson one back 
Um, now I've got I've got the red, white, and blue actually because uh, I had the cobalt from the elevations uh, traded into the white one, and then you know had the uh, had the uh, the audacity, if you will, <laughs> the luck, the craziness. This is white and certified. Um, had the luck to be able to grab the crimson one back because we did it during an elevation crate opening. So I'm just I'm stoked. Go check out if you're. Crate opening fan, we've got a ton of them. We've got a ton of them. You can go back. We took a, a little hiatus break, but we're really hitting this thing hard now. Uh, just because this has been so much fun. That's the other big thing about doing this. Just about Rocket League in a game in general. You guys know this if you've been playing games. Sometimes you just get wore out. I won't necessarily say I personally got wore out on Rocket League. It just, I don't know. There was a period of time. I guess I did get a little wore out. Uh, I'll take that back. I did get a little wore out. I think part of it was because I was so heavy into the trading scene of things. I was really trying to get a lot going. Uh, I made a crazy amount of trade-ups and, and trades and was just really working the items. Yes! Let's go! Let's freaking go! I told you, Fire God. We got them all. We just did it. We hit it. We got every single black market out of this. Multiples of some of them. And we just spiked a fire god. And we're back. We're back to doing this at the beginning of these crates. Well, we're 12 in. So, let's go, fire god. Let's go. Oh, man. Now, that's it. We got them. We hit, we hit the black markets. Show me some white zambas. That's all we need. I will, I will walk off into the sunset with my bundles of digital items in my arms. <laughs> I'm stoked. I'm stoked about that. Um, that's kind of like a completionist. That's like a little mini crate opening achievement that we just hit to hit all these black markets out of this crate. I'm stoked about that. That is awesome. That is awesome. And to start this thing off with one of those two is so good. 12 in. So we did it on the second crate. I think we did it on the fourth crate. We did it on the 10th crate. Uh, and we just did it on the 12th crate. So... I, I can't, uh, cannot be upset about that at all. And again, that's the way to start this. This is going to be a good crate opening now. Just because we hit that. We've got some of the bonus stuff at the end for the trade-ups. But this is already a good crate opening. And I hope you guys are enjoying. Really. I hope you enjoyed this whole series. I hope you enjoyed all these crate openings as, as much as I did. Um, I know sometimes I'm a little bit more reserved with some of my, my reactions. Uh, sometimes, honestly, it's just disbelief. Sincerely, it's just disbelief that we continue to hit this stuff opening after opening after opening. To be able to say that we got a black market decal out of every single one of these openings, multiples on some of them, painted on, on top of some of those, is incredible. And to be able to say we hit them all is even more incredible. And multiples of some of them... I just, guys, I'm just, I sit here and sometimes I shake my head and it's just been nuts. This weekend's been so awesome for this. I've had so much fun doing this. This is, here's the thing, you know, Psionics, say what you will, they want to make these double paint and weekend special. I'm okay with them being a couple times a year. I would not be mad if they were a little bit more often because what's the harm in it, right? Uh, what's the harm in giving people the opportunity to grab some painted items? And here's the nice thing, is if you do these, again, if you work the rocket pass, you throw down some keys, or you can trade into the keys, you use some of those items to grab some more keys, and then you open a couple crates. If you hit something crazy, it just kind of fuels the trading market. Um, it entices people to open some stuff up. If you got PCCs or crates lying around, it's just so much fun. It's so much fun for so many people. It's obviously awesome for somebody like me, who you know kind of dabbles in the content creator space and does the YouTube thing and shares my experience with you guys so that's obviously always neat right this it gives me an opportunity to do some cool stuff with the community and show you guys um, what this game has to offer and what an event like this is so I, I appreciate that and that's a ton of fun but just for the average player out there that doesn't do this it just opens the door for so much for so much extra excitement. And again, I have a gambler's mentality. That's why I do this. Uh, that's why I enjoy this so much. And it's so much fun to do. Because you hit moments like that, man. That fire god. Like, 
obviously dissolver would have been better from a key standpoint but to hit the fire god and be able to say hey i got every single black market and multiples of some of them out of this crate in the course of a couple hundred crates that we've opened is pretty cool like i said achievement unlock give me some gamer score for that uh i'm on xbox by the way so i don't do trophies sorry playstation 4 and i don't know if steam has anything or switch i'm sure there's a system i'm not too familiar been playing with my switch been enjoying pokemon let's go pikachu super super fun that's black i think this is a good octane lone wolf um we're gonna get close to the set on that i think as well so looking for black domains and the the mystical white zombas oh i thought we were gonna get zombas i'm okay skipping by the zombas the ones that we want to get and hit need to be painted for us that'd be great I'm curious to see where this one's going to end up. We only hit one exotic this past, uh, the past opening. The one before that, we hit like a crazy amount of exotics. So I'm kind of curious to see where we're going to feel out on those. And I'm also curious to see if we can snag up. I'm, I have, for some reason, something's, something in my gut is telling me that we're going to hit one more black market. I don't know why. That might just be intuition. That might just be... I'm riding the, the real high wave of luck, and I know this is the last one I'm, last opening I'm doing, so we'll see. I have this, uh, like, deep down, like, kind of semi good feeling as well that we're going to get the Zombas, but I don't know. It's feeling like, I don't know. I don't want to say it. So we're just going to see how it goes. Like I said, already to grab Fire God is sweet. Uh, to grab some of this extra stuff that we're going to be able to pull is going to be a ton of fun. And I've just, I don't know, I can't say enough. I can't say enough to you guys as well, just to say thanks um, for the support. The views on the videos show me that you guys, show me and Sloth that you guys are enjoying the content, which again entices us to continue to do more of it and to want to be consistent with it. This is Burnt Sienna? Yeah, Burnt Sienna. I don't think we actually have a Burnt Sienna one, I'm not sure. We'll have to take a look. We're doing really well on the Twinsers too. Um, we'll, we'll see that as we go through the trade-ups. But we've done really well on a lot of these categories to really kind of put some of these sets together. This is Forest Green, so that's pretty cool. Again, Jaegers is just another thing. We got two painted imports back to back, or Lime. No, I think that's Forest Green. Yeah, pretty sure. We've done really well on those. We've done really well on the imports. We've done really well on the wheels. Um, we've obviously opened a ton of these. So overall, again, can't be mad about it. Cannot be mad about it. Can't be mad. We're going to have some good trade up, some good items for trade ups. Again, we'll, we're going to jump right into this. This one will be a little bit longer of a video. Again, I do apologize, but I like to kind of cap these things off with kind of a really neat way to finish this. And hopefully we can finish this really, really well with a couple of the items that we're looking for. That, I believe, is Cobalt. That's neat. Again, another nice, solid painted import. Now, if we do have some of these extra painted imports, specifically the comments, I'll probably work. If, if we're close on the trade-ups, we'll do those, just like we did during the trade-up episode. Those are Saffron or Lime. I always get them. The thumbnails are always close. Those are definitely Lime, painted and certified. Beautiful. Done really well on the Reapers as well. Two pairs of Titanium White Reapers in the last one was really good. Got some some chalk, some chalk rooms. Just a good wheel too, really clean wheel. I like these. All the wheels in this one, Mwah. mucho good. That's not even that's not even good English or Spanish. Yamains. And still hoping for a black pair of these. We've we've hit, we've kind of slowed down on those. We did the first couple openings. We were really spiking a lot of the colors on those. Not so much these past couple. Maybe like one or two here and there, here or there, which again isn't bad. Octane Lone Wolf certified. About halfway through, and already again, fire guard at the start. <laughs> I 
So happy about that. A couple of decent little items in between here. Again, curious to see how we're going to do on the exotics. Exotics have been really kind of... Exotics have been the one thing, I guess, as I'm looking back and thinking about these, that have surprised me the most out of this crate. Surprised me the most out of it. Just because they've been so, like, back and forth, you know? We haven't seen a ton of them. Then we saw a lot of them. Then we've seen, like, one or two. So, kind of curious on that. Starlighter decal. One of my all-time most painted items, I think, that we've ever opened. <laughs> Just because we've gotten so many in the past. There's another one. Striking out on the paint on that. That's fine. It's saving it for the better items. That's exactly what it's doing. And the Dragon Lord. Again, I'll I'll take some regular imports too here. I'm gonna make the trade ups at the end of this better, but very rares and very rares are fine as well. It all adds up, folks. Definitely all adds up. That was the other thing too, you know, I was really thinking about trade ups versus crate openings. You know, when I compare them. Obviously my crate openings have just been nuts. But with that being said, I've had a higher portion of crates, obviously, than I have of trade-ups. So I might not be getting the trade-ups a fair shake. Because we did pretty good on, on some of those. Kind of did a, a, a Rocket League inventory clean-out, which we're going to do 100% after this is all said and done. We're gonna move some items, trade some things. I was really trying to just kind of hang on to a lot of the stuff that I got. Unless there was a quick demand or I could... Uh, you know, some of the stuff's pretty easy to move, so we kind of move those quickly to kind of fuel some of the other openings, specifically this one, with so many crates, so many keys. So we got 27 left. We'll see how we do here. I'm feeling pretty good still. Really feeling the luck has been good with to us. Let's see how the luck kind of closes out for us. Still feeling good. I still got a decent feeling on these, on these here, uh, He's here Zombas. Also, I, again, I don't know why. I'm just feeling another black market. My intuition has not been too wrong as of late, but I might be, I might be over exaggerating my my thoughts here, my feelings. But I hope sincerely. You know, this is a couple days after double painted, double XP, all that good stuff is over. Really hope you guys had a fun time during this. This is orange. Again, doing well on the painted import bodies. Orange, I think. Yep, definitely orange. That's a good looking. That's a good looking orange on that car. Again, if you've been a fan for the for, of the channel for a while, you know that I was using the Jaeger uh, in some of the videos. There's some. I'll say those are cobalt. Cobalt. They look cobalt. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful wheels. Like that blue. Cobalt really stands out on those wheels. Again, Reaper's just good. Just a good, good looking wheel. I like the, like I said, I like the way they did it. Especially if you're kind of got a white, like a white setup on the car, white body, on the car you're using. You can really match some stuff up cool uh, with those. And some people don't like the two tone wheels. You know, some people really like, like the Yamains, for instance. One really solid especially if it's painted one really solid color I, in my opinion there's just opportunities for both right really got to find the best wheel for your setups I've definitely gotten uh, to be a big fan as of late I, I'm just and I go back and forth with this a lot with my car designs I just like the really clean stuff right now that's kind of the phase I'm in like a really clean you know again mainframe looking really clean with the lines I've got uh, the Aero Mage wheels on, just looking really clean with those. But I go back and forth. Sometimes I like to go flashy. I definitely used, you know, different colors of Dracos and Equalizers was a big set that I had that I really enjoyed. We've really kind of slowed down here, so I'm kind of curious to see how we're going to finish up. We've got 19 left. 
still a good portion of crates to crack open. Still good opportunities. 19 more opportunities for them Zombas. I don't know if we'll need that many. Look at, did you guys just see? Oh no. Oh no, guys. That was it. That was a chance. I'm a little nervous now. We just hit the exotic. Didn't get any paint on him. Gosh, if that would have been it, I'd have been so stoked. We just haven't seen, minus that one opening, we just haven't seen a ton of exotics out of the crate. And uh, I'm a little nervous now. Now, obviously, again, there's odds we can easily pull them. Gonna have to see how we do here. I would have liked to see those painted. I would have liked to see them, those zombies, to be able to snag them to be painted for sure. Oh man! Now it's really giving it to us because. <laughs> It said you got the fire god at the beginning and that's what you're gonna get. And I just got two sets of exotic wheels with no paint on them. That's a little rough. Missed the dice roll on that end. On those for sure. And that's part of it guys. That's part of it. At some point I knew the luck was gonna kinda start to tail off a little bit but still happy with this opening like I said. Fire god solid I'm hoping we can maybe snag something else here as we kind of close this out and uh, but at some point the the odds start to go in your favor or start to go less in your favor seems kind of like we're on the downhill slope a little bit and this is probably a good time like I said this is definitely it for the opening uh, you're seeing this quite a few days after the double painted but I know for fact we were done we're not doing any more um, it's just been so much fun though. Like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed this whole series and just kind of what we were doing over the past couple days and, and uh, just enjoying the, the highs because it's been a lot of them. There hasn't really been many lows. There's been a lot of highs this double painted weekend in this, this series of, of opening these crates that we're working on and the trade ups and everything else that we did. And we don't, you know, that's the other thing. Don't want to turn into, it's just. Honestly, it's it's easy. It's fun content. It also gives me an opportunity to kind of just chat with you guys, um, and then obviously to continue to chat. If you you know throw comments down below, um, really sincerely do our best to try to talk with all of you and get to chat with you. Especially if you put a comment on. Can't always, um, but if we do, try to give you a thumbs up and a like and. Uh, and just connect with you because that's really part of the fun. Honestly, it's part of the fun. Uh, it makes it enjoyable as well because I know there's a lot of people out there that really like this really like watching crate openings like I do really enjoy this game 100% huge huge community on this game especially as the competitive scenes really started to ramp up um, we've got a couple of neat competitive term tournaments coming up these are cobalt and I don't know I think we actually need these so this is pretty cool I'm not sure I can't remember off the top of my head. I know we need crimson, and I know we need black. I think cobalt might have actually been the other one that we did need. If not, that's cool. It's still solid. We haven't seen Pain of the Yamains in a little while, so I'm pretty stoked about that. But we got a couple of, um, to kind of close the year out, I know there's a couple of other competitive Rocket League events coming up. I know the Collegiate Rocket League uh, is closing out. I think December 8th is their the weekend of December 8th is their tournament and kind of their their finales, their championships. So definitely tune in for that. It's teasing me now with these zombies, guys. It's teasing me. <laughs> we might have to we might have to cross our fingers and our toes as we kind of get into our trade ups and hopefully we can the luck can kind of shift to those. We'll see. Maybe, you know, I'm, I'm all for... These are sky blue. These are sky blue. That's a solid pull. Happy with these. These are cool. I think we are actually already at sky blue or cobalt. Are those cobalt? Those are cobalt. Again, the thumbnail, the shades, just off. We'll see. We'll check what the certifications are. See how we did. I would be fine. You know, we, we kind of went back and forth 
hitting really good items at the beginning. Then we had last episode where we hit a lot of good items at the end. I'm okay with hitting good items at the beginning and the end. Psionic, Froggy Leaf. Hook us up. Last one we're doing. We got four left here. Four left. I'll take a, I'll take a Solar Flare, guys. You guys know me. Take one. Not doing bad as far as the number of colors that we have. <laughs> Hitting that crimson one was so cool this past episode. Super, super excited about that. Three left, three left. We'll take a quick snapshot of the inventory and then we will go and we will jump right into the trade ups. So hopefully, not take too much more of y'all's time. And there's some, again, so I'm going to say this. I think they're orange. I might be wrong. They're probably burnt sienna, actually. I don't know what it is, man. The thumbnails just seem to be a little off for me. Let me know if you guys are experiencing the same thing. If you open some crates and you get some thumbnails like I'm seeing, are you guys seeing the same color I am? If you aren't, that's fine. Tell me. I might just... I don't think I'm colorblind. Pretty sure I'm not. <laughs> um, just they seem to be a little off. So here we go, ladies and gents. Here we go. The final... PCC crate for a three part series and really just our long double painted double drop double XP weekend. Thank you guys. Thank you. This one's for you guys. This one's for you. Hopefully it's good. Hopefully it reps the community well. If it's crap item, it's not for you. I'll take the crap item. <laughs> well, I'm going to take all the items. but And of course, as we would finish out naturally, we're going to get a Starlighter probably painted. Yep, why would we not? <laughs> why would that's a very fitting way to end this? Still a really solid opening. Let's take a look at what we got here. And then we will jump again right into we will jump right into the trade ups as quickly as we can. So so they were being burnt sienna, guardian, we got cobalt turtle, cool, we got cobalt of these, neat. We did get two black dumb funny books, cool, cool. And orange one of those. Lime Juggler on those. Four screen score. So solid third on that. We did get a Burnt Sienna Twins or Body there. Got Black Octane Lone Wolf. Four screen there. We did grab that Fire God. Titanium White Juggler. What else do we have here? I think that's about it, guys. So again, not the craziest of openings, but obviously we still hit the Black Market. We still hit the Fire God. We got some cool painted bodies in here. And again, I'm sure we've got some other stuff in here that's kind of stacking with some other things. This is obviously way less items than we had opened. Um, so let's just jump into this. Let's go ahead and do that. We'll go alphabetical and let's start with the rares and we will go from there. Let's see, it's the fastest way to get to the PCC items. And again, we've just got a ton, guys, we've just got a ton of these. So we're gonna click through this as quickly as we can. Let's see what we get. Certified, cool. We don't have to go too far for this, but we'll work. We'll work to the bottom first. So we know we're gonna get rid of all these. Boom, Reaper wheels. Again, and I do apologize. I know these. This this is gonna be what takes up a good chunk, an additional chunk of the time. Um, but we'll go from there with this. Let's see. We're gonna we'll hold off on trying to trade in any of these. We got just too many of those. Um, I want to take that off and go one of these again. We have just got so many. There is some purple reapers. This is kind of the fun part because again, all so many of these. Um. So many of these very rares are awesome. That looks like orange. Orange on those. So that's pretty cool. Going as quick as the fingers. Those are saffron. Quick as my fingers will take me. Again, we don't want to accidentally get rid of anything that we're going to end up wanting, but we do want to work towards as many as we can on the okay to get rid of basically all of the Ooh, see that's what we don't want to do we don't want to accidentally get rid of that there we go we got 
a soldier one we can get rid of. There's some forest green Gaidens. It's just so much good stuff at the uh, at the very rare slot, honestly. There's some forest green chalks. We're doing well. Let's keep up the pain of luck here. That's what we're hoping for. There's some more painted young mains. Can we just get some black? The guy's black. That's really what we want. That would make me pretty happy here. I guess we'll keep the aviator one. Plenty of regular Dom funny books, so we'll work with those. Those look like saffron. These are right here, which is nice. Saffron. We'll be taking a look at all that stuff as we get closer to it. Alright, so let's see here. Black, gray, forest green, pink, crimson, sky blue, striker one. Get rid of the turtle. Nope, we don't want to get rid of that one. That's not painted. We can get rid of both of these. Regular chakrams. All right, let's see what else we got. We can get rid of the guardian. Keep the playmaker. We'll get rid of the show off one. We got three titanium white. We don't want to get rid of any of those. We don't want to get rid of the crimson or the black ones, I don't think. Got to pink one of these. I think we'll give up one of those. Let's see if we can't get to... Oh, I've got pearlescent mats for days. For days. So there we go. We'll move into these then. A couple more, a couple more. We're getting there. We are getting there. So hang tight with me here. As quick as we can, quick as we can. Paint certified, good color. Not even sure, not even gonna check. Just gonna keep moving here. Having big bundles of these is awesome. There's cobalt, I think, of those. Got psionics. You can make this really easy if I could search search by crate. Would be great. All right, so we want to hang out of that. Um, there's a score one. Yeah, we'll get rid of the orange one. We'll ha we'll hang on to the starlighter decals for the time being, and just to see if we'll need an extra. Very rare. We may if we're if we're one very rare short, we'll get rid of some of these for sure because we've got some we can. Everything else here, I'm probably going to hang on to. We do got some spare extra lone wolves and some things like that, so which is okay. Let's jump into the very rares here. Let's see how we do. First of all, we need to just take a look. Quick inventory. So saffron on those. Lime show off, I think, are new. Gaidens, those are Gaidens. Gaidens, not bad. On, not doing bad on the Gaidens, honestly. Tons of Reaper wheels, as you guys can see. I mean, we got two of the orange. All right, so not terrible. We'll see how we do here. We'll just move through these. We don't accidentally want to trade up anything we don't need to here, but these have the potential to be some pretty cool stuff here. Painted to comment to get us rolling and started here. This, will, this portion will be much shorter just because we have a lot less of these. And again, we'll do inventory. That's a purple Jaeger. Solid color. Really solid color, honestly. Okay, we got some regular jocks. That's from the wrong series. So, apologize. Okay, get rid of the aviator ones and those. I don't care too much about hanging on to these. We'll keep the playmaker ones. Get rid of the turtle. Let's see what we got here. Regular import the body. Put these up. Hold on, make sure to not accidentally get rid of them. 
I think we got five of these standard ones. Let's see what we got here. Paint the comment. Doing well on painting the comments on the trade ups here. Yeah, we'll throw those in there. Okay, let's take these out just to make sure we don't screw that up. And let's see here. Maybe we'll go down to the uh, mains. We don't want the juggler. We've got some extra ones of these. There's a pink Twinser. I know we have that one already for sure. Just because it's so it's such a distinctive color. Really, really pops on that car. Five of those. Make sure those are all in there. Boom. A painted Comet. A lot of painted Comets from these very rare trade-ups. Yeah, no complaints on this side. Yeah, I don't necessarily care too much about those two now that we have that. Those are regular turtle ones. Let's take the chocks out of here and it looks like we're on standard reapers. We get rid of two of these. Certified Jaeger. All right, let's see what this brings us. This might be our last one. Oh wait, we have sniper regular. Wait, did I see those earlier? Those are sniper regular, so we'll get rid of those. Might be able to get one more in after this. We'll, we'll have to take a look. We'll check, let's see what we get here. Painted certified comet. So a lot of boosts. A lot of comet boosts, not, not upset. Just bear with me. I did it again. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to go quick here. Okay, let's see. Let's see. So I'd be fine to get rid of a burnt sienna one of these. Let's take this out. We'll keep the playmaker there. We can find it with an orange one as well. I'll keep the playmaker ones in those. Let's get rid of these two. All right, now we need. We'll, let's find one additional spare color. You know, cobalt ones. Of those we obviously don't get rid of. Titanium white. What else do we got? We got three of the sky blue. Actually, let me take that back. No, we'll go with the sky blue. We will do the sky blue, and this should just about wrap us up. Again, we'll come back to see. And take a look if we need one more import. Let's take a quick loose look at the boosts that we ended up pulling here. So we got saffron, saffron. Nothing too crazy, honestly, for colors. We're gonna see how we do here. All right, we are on to the goodies. The goodies, the goodies. Not sure how many of these we are going to have, but we're gonna work through these. We got three of the black ones of these, which is just insane. We don't need two of the juggler ones of these. We got some standard ones. Let's get rid of the acrobat. All right, here we go. So these are the big ones. We just want those white zombies, baby. One time. Here we go. Let's really spike this. Let's finish this series off with just a banger, just a freaking banger. Here we go, here we go. Whew. Not bad, not bad, we'll take them. Not a decent start, decent start. Again, we're getting close. It might tease us, Rocket League has a way of doing that. <laughs> yes it does, but not a bad start. We'll get rid of the sweeper one. Try to hang on to the score twins are there. Here we go. Next chance. Let's see what we get. See how we do. Regular Dracos. Ooh, see that one hurts. Again, we want we want these imports to be good. We want the trade-ups to at least turn into some colors. That's what we're hoping for. Gosh, and we're gonna struggle here, I think. On the import side of things. We'll we'll do the score twins are. I really don't want to get rid of the, any of these, but we'll do a burnt sienna. Guys, we are going to struggle for this, I think. It's 
hard sled in here just because we've got some colors we really don't want to get rid of. We got two pink Twinsers. I don't know what's going to move easier, Comet Boosts or Pink Twinsers. This might be it on the trade-ups, guys, honestly. Whew. We've just got so much stuff I want to hang on to is the problem here. I mean, I guess we could do these, these Comet Boosts. I mean, one, two, we'll have one more of these, three, four. We might be able to get one more in after this. If we get the white zombies here, we're not going to need to. So let's see how we do here. Let's see how we do. Cross your fingers. <laughs> Painted infiniums. Not bad. Not bad. All right. Well, let's let's shoot for one more. We'll shoot for one more here. We're gonna we're gonna end up giving up uh, some colors of these, I think, which is which is okay. Well, let's keep this cert one. Get rid of that one here. Do we have any duplicates of anything here? See, I would get rid of that normally because nobody's going to want that. I really want to hang on to these. You know, Aviator, Burnt Sienna, and. I don't know, Cobalt? Or Pink? It's a toss up. I think these are going to be the hardest to move. This is it, ladies and gentlemen. This is it. We'll go through these, then we'll take a look at the full inventory of how we ended up doing. As always, doesn't really matter what this is going to be. Thank you for the support. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Still a solid opening, solid trade-up so far. We'll see what we can end up pulling here. All in all, really awesome series, and really just appreciate the support. I can't say that enough. Um, just thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching. If you made it through the whole video, as always, these are long ones. You're the real MVP. Post something down below. Let me know that you did. Just let us know how you're doing. I'd love to chat with you guys. So here we go. Last one. Last one. Big money, big money, big money. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> oh, two painted Zambas. Two painted Zambas. We could not hit the titanium white ones so close what do we get burnt sienna and we got pink so all in all we'll take a look at our inventory here we'll just take a quick look at how we ended up doing overall um opening really from fire god 4 not bad um you guys can see here we didn't do too bad on the trade-ups honestly some really good trade-ups a lot of good painted stuff right through here obviously we traded up a lot of just the standard stuff um all in all, pretty pumped about this. This has been such a fun series. So much awesome stuff. We can just kind of scroll through here and you're going to see um, just some of the nuts stuff that we ended up pulling. A lot of painted infiniums, different versions of painted Zombas, Dracos. Um, we got the Ragens. I mean, this is really what our trade-ups were from the last time. Um, so just some really cool, really cool stuff. Uh, black Gurnauts, again, we got just nuts on the painted bodies. So many titanium white painted bodies, uh, which is awesome. Absolutely awesome. Yamains, um, just, you know, some Zombas here. I just, I can't say enough about it. Obviously, we got the Saffron Solar Flare. Um, I think I traded for that. I just, it's been such a good series and time and i'm not sure why this is doing this like this this is kind of weird but uh overall tons of fun hopefully you really enjoyed uh i know i certainly did thank you so very much again for watching we'll wrap it up here um stay tuned to the channel a lot more content coming not sure what we're going to do next obviously we'll keep you up to date on any news that we have going forward and uh and as always just love and appreciate the support uh gonna be trying to work in some other stuff uh, and uh, just stay tuned to the channel. Thank you so much. Average, Doc from Average Gamer, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you in the next one. See ya.